Friday Night Football, and it's Hawthorne versus North Melbourne. Hello, I'm Dennis Cometti. Half the seats are filled. I think that's as good as it's going to get. And joining me in the box for special comments will be Matthew Richardson. Thanks, Dennis. I've been looking forward to this one all week. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. We have the toss of the coin. Hawthorne kicking to the left of screen. The players are all eagerly awaiting the siren. Look at the players, Richard. They look ready for this one. You're right, Dennis. Tarrant comes away with the ball. Takes possession. Zebel feeds it wide. Oh, you can really tell he loves taking a contested mark. Higgins kicks. He had his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. Athlete with the kick. Jacobs has a great set of hands. Fantastic mark. Slams it on the boot. Wood wins the marking contest. 40 meters out. Well, if you can hand pick a position, this is it. Straight in front of the goals. Goal for Wood. Good start by North Melbourne. And that goal is right off the top shelf for him. Wood loves that. A brief moment of serenity before the ball is bounced and the Ruckman unleash. Guided by Gore. Clean hands with a difficult bouncing ball. The umpire will ball it up. It's tapped down nicely. He slams that on the boot. O'Brien with the ball. He slams that on the boot. A great mark under pressure. Tarrant kicks it. He grabs it. He kicks it long. McDonald decisively. Guided by Zebel. Gathered by Cunnington. Has it now. Kicks it. The ball crosses the line. All eyes on the ball as the Ruckman battle it out. McAvoy knocks it down the field. Cunnington gets a less than pretty drop cut away. 50 metres from home, kicked by Higgins. Steady hands there as he holds that one. 35 metres out, a pretty safe bet from this position. Pinpoint accuracy from Jacobs. The Kangaroos couldn't have asked for a much better start than this one. Jacobs can achieve anything he sets his mind to. The sky is the limit for this guy. The kick is about as straight as a shopping trolley, and it's a goal. He's enjoying that goal, and why not? Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Wood gets the ball. Puts boot to ball. Higgins spills it. The loose ball is picked up. Jure taps the ball. Shields gets the footy. 
Rovat collects it. He gathers the ball. Williams has the ball. He kicks the ball. Concentration comes out of a combination of confidence and hunger. So they tell him. Higgins slams one on the boot for goal. He's driven that ball hard, but it's a miss. A quick start by North Melbourne. Needs someone to break hard. He's ready to bring it back into play. Picked by Stratton. He gathers the loose ball. He shows the quick hands. Picked by Mitchell. Marks. It's no wonder Cawthorn for falling behind with a marking count like that. If they don't start getting into the contest and start taking some marks, this game will be lost for them. Sending it on its way. Williams with the ball. He kicks the ball. The mark will be paid. He gets boot to the ball. Jure having no trouble taking that one. Puts boot to ball. Kept his composure then. Bumps the big skin. The contest, no match for him. 35 metres out. Going for goal number one. Richo, help me out here. What was he thinking? Ice cream. It's my best guess. The Kangaroos have been so precise with their disposal and with their delivery, their forwards have been receiving. It's no wonder the Hawks were starting to fall behind. Gunston goes for home. That's a great goal. Oh, he'll be loving that goal when he sees it in the highlights package. Gunston is relieved to see that one go through. All is in readiness. Here's the bounce. McAvoy hits it. A favorable bounce. My ball, says the umpire. Claimed by Gore. Atley kicks it. Nice work from Williams. Williams got a really good footballing brain. He gets it under pressure. Cunnington with the kick. A great mark under pressure. Crawley puts his boot on it. Rioli decisively. The Ruckman jostle for position. Good tap from McAvoy. Athlete is dragged down by Mitchell. Clean tap by Cunnington. Penetrating hand pass. Interception. Booted by Thor. Wood gets the tap. He brings it out of the pack. And the mark will be paid. The Roback just gauging which way that wind is blowing. Well, you can really tell he loves taking a contested mark. 40 minutes from home. Choose to kick it. The contest no match for him. 25 metres out. A pretty safe bet from this position. Goal for Higgins. That will settle his nerves. The first goal is always welcome. Higgins is creative with his game. He always makes an appearance on the highlight reel. There's one for the time capsule. Congratulated by his teammates. A brief moment of serenity before the ball is bounced and the Ruckman unleash. Tapped by Gore. He's got the footy in his hands. And it will be bowled up. A good hit out there. It gets tapped. Sicily with the tap. Zebul gets onto the ball. Jure with the tap. Even under extreme pressure, he's got the handball out. Zebul has the ball. He grabs the footy. Puts boot to ball. The ball over the line. We'll get a ball in. You can see the determination on the Ruckman's faces. McAvoy hits it, is in his possession. Shields with a big bump to Glover. Wood aims for his man on the ground. The loose ball scooped up. Higgins shoots. It's gone through for a magnificent behind. North Melbourne with a healthy gap on the scoreboard, leading the Hawks 20 to 7. Stratton has a fair kick on him. I expect him to roost this down the middle. Jams it on the boot. Deft touch from Shields. Tapped by Burgoyne. 
Cunnington starts in. His shadow beside him. Where else would it be? Well, depends on the side. DeMont going for number one. The Kangaroos in front. Looks like he'll go out wide. He plays it to himself. Kicks the skin off it. Stuck the mitts out and held on to it. Goes up the line. Wins the hard ball. Gets boot to high. Nice mark under pressure. A lovely drop punt. There's the siren for the end of the quarter. The scores at the Kangaroos, 21, to the Hawks, 7. We're looking at a team who's afraid to look bad. As a player, when I saw the trepidation, I knew we would win every time. Hawthorne will really need to address that at quarter time if they're to get back into this game. Time to take a look at the stats. Not a lot of difference in the tackling stats. North Melbourne was slightly ahead with 7 to 6. Neither team are giving an inch in the terms of marking. North Melbourne on 15 and caught. Let's go back to the action. Develop the winning edge. Small differences in your performance can lead to large differences in your results. Kicks. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. He's on a 30-degree angle. Sends it on its way. Perspiring like a pudding in a pot as he lines the shot up. 35 metres out. Going for goal number one. Goal to the Hawks. Two goals will see Hawthorne in the lead. Sicily is creative with his game. He always makes an appearance on the highlight reel. And that goal is right off the top shelf for him. He acknowledges the crowd. A brief moment of serenity before the ball is bounced and the Ruckman unleash. Dork didn't even get close to that tap. And the ball goes over the boundary near the 50. Umpire lets it loose. Tap to advantage. He gets his hands on the footy. McDonald sends the ball on its way. Strong mark. Sends it on its way. Burgoyne looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. Nice hands. The North Melbourne big men are not pulling down many marks inside the 50 with most of the, the Kangaroos scoring opportunities coming from shots on the run. He gets boot to the ball. Wood with the mark. That had some power behind it. Great mark under pressure. 40 metres from home. A chance to add one more to his tally. North Melbourne had one to their tally. The Kangaroos lead Hawthorne by 14. Lucky we have that goal recorded because it was first right. His teammates rush over. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Dork looked about as coordinated as Disney's Goofy. Burgoyne controls. Taron intercepts it. The bouncing ball is controlled. His mistake costs him a possession. He's got the football now. Boots it. O'Brien with the mark. Choose to kick it. So well timed. O'Brien taps it. O'Brien taps. Wright charges fiercely with a powerful bump. Clark spears the ball. A great effort. Atlee shown a lot of character with his recent performances. Gore slams the ball to his boot. Cunnington puts his boot on it. That's a mark. It comes off the side of the boot. He claims the ball. Sending it on its way. Wood with good strong hands. 40 minutes from home. Wood lets fly with a shot at goal. Never looked like going through. North Melbourne by 15 points. Stratton is creative with his game. He always makes an appearance on the highlight reel. He kicks the ball. Higgins with the mark. 
Higgins has a kick. It's in the air. Oh, and it's gone through for a behind. He has a few options. Stratton kicks to himself. Gets boot to high. No one troubling him there. Gets the kick out of the defensive 50. Shields couldn't hold on to that one. Deft touch from Mitchell. Burgoyne taps. It bounced straight into his hands as if he'd just called a puppy with a whistle. Choose to kick it. Sicily grabs that one. 50 meters out. Going for goal number two. McMillan is able to grab it on the half volley. Gathered by Roost. Good tap from Roost. Takes possession. Chalk up a goal for the Hawks. Henderson sinking his first goal. Two goals will see Hawthorne in the lead. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. The bounce. McAvoy got the hit out. He gathers the loose ball. And now we'll have a ball up. McAvoy, he's a smart guy, but he's got to keep a cool ahead so he can make the right decisions more often. Sicily shoots for goal. Only a behind. There could be a short option here. He kicks it to himself. Jams it on the boot. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Concentration comes out of a combination of confidence and hunger. So it's on 40 meters from home. A set shot on a 45 degree angle for Crioli. 25 meters out. A chance to add one more to his tally. Hawthorne won't be too nervous yet. They can still turn this around. North Melbourne have been taking the time to size up the right option at the right time so they haven't been hurt on the turnover. And that's why they're on track to win this match. He boots it. He gets it under pressure. He boots it. O'Brien marks the ball. A set shot on a 45-degree angle. Taron claims it. Keeps it close to the ground. He wins the contest. Boots it. Shields read the play better than anyone else and takes possession. Marks. He kicks it. Going, going. The goal eludes him just wide of the target. Two goals will see Hawthorne in the lead. Thompson waiting to bring it back into play. Plays on. Jams it on the boot. McDonald claims it. McDonald can read the play really well. I think he's definitely on his way to becoming one of the best in the league. He kicks the ball. Mitchell marks it. Puopolo gets the footy. Sending it on its way. That's a nice strong mark. Lining it up with the goal now. Kicked by Gunston. Strong mark by Bruce. He kicks it. Richo, what can we say about that attempt? I think you've just got to take him off after that. The half is almost over. Thompson quitting to bring it back into play. Roost ran to meet the ball and took the mark superbly. These two sides will be deadlocked if he puts this through. That's two in a row for Hawthorne. You get the feeling something big is brewing. I gotta say, that's even a better goal the second time around. Roost happy. The Rucks prepare to go at it for this bounce. More bounce than a dodgy chip. Palms it down nicely. A favorable bounce. My ball, says the umpire. That's it for the second quarter. What do you think of it now, Richo? The scores are tied at the end of the second quarter. Let's go to Richo now and take a look at the stats. North Melbourne with 52 kicks and Hawthorne with 40 kicks. 
Not much in it. Thanks for that, Richard. This match can be described like seeing your grandmother in fishnets. Unexpected. Second half is underway. I'll tell you what, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. McAvoy punches it. Mitchell lobs the pass. Approaching the goals now. Sicily gets that cruel behind. Hawthorne by a point. Needs someone to break hard. He's ready to bring it back into play. McMillan ran to meet the ball and took the mark superbly. He had his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. Kicks into the middle. Puopolo, enjoying a height advantage, bumps the big skin. It was all his. As cool as a prize marrow as he lines up for this shot. Rioli with the kick. The ball goes over the boundary in the pocket. A lot of jostling as the boundary umpire puts the ball back into play. Puopolo finds his man on the move. McAvoy pulls the trigger with the ball sailing for goal. The Hawks by two points. Thompson is the heart and soul of this footy club. I don't think he'll be going anywhere anytime soon. He's got a hold of that one. Right, just wanted it more then. Puts boot to ball. He takes the contested mark. Tarrant kicks it. Atley with a strong mark. Sending it on its way. Door with the mark. A rushed kick, marked by Burgoyne. He's got the evasiveness and the flashy tricks of a star. Passes by hand. Oh, nice one too. McAvoy with his head down, he gets the upper hand. Roost with a kick at goal. He had perfect control over the ball right up until the minute he kicked it. But they narrowed the goalpost at one end. That ball is just not hitting the target. Put the Hawks. Wins the hard ball. Puts boot to ball. Turner guides it. Atley taps. Door aims for his man on the ground. Grabs the footy. That ball is becoming a yo-yo for him. It keeps coming back. A spearing kick from Parton. Nice work from Impey. Nice bit of power there. Virtual claims it. Virtual is creative with his game. He always makes an appearance on the highlight reel. Burgoyne gets onto the ball. Turner gets onto the ball. Clark there to mop up. It's tapped down nicely. He lays off the pass. Kicks to the attacking 50. Jams it on the boot now. Tarrant gets the mark without contest. Gets boot to leather. Nice hands. Kicks it. Great mark. Slams it on the boot. He sneaks away for an uncontested mark. Kicks it. A solid mark from Grovac. Grovac has shown a lot of character with his recent performances. McAvoy with the spoil. He knocks it down. Higgins going for home. It gets tapped. Wood gains the loose ball. McAvoy totally outclassed in that contest. He gets his hands on the footy. He's running hot, Richard. Well, Dennis, I just think he's having fun with them now. That ball is becoming a yo-yo for him. It keeps coming back. Cleanly tapped out of the ruck. Wood tackles him to the ground. McAvoy gets possession. No one around troubling him there. Rovat kicks it. Atlee marks the ball. He kicks it long. Impey takes the mark. Jams it on the boot now. Great mark. Burton sends the ball on its way. He had his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. Strong mark. Chips it down towards half forward. O'Brien got under it. Picks it. 
He had his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. He spears the ball. Let's have the shot at goal. Is as good as the delivery. Sicily launches it. Marks. Gunston with a chance if he keeps a cool head. 50 metres out. Going for goal number two. It's in the air. Drifts wide to go through for the behind. But they narrowed the goalpost at one end. That ball is just not hitting the target for Hawthorne. Thompson waiting for the man to free up. McMillan, the better man there. McMillan, he's got a few tricks up his sleeve, so defenders will have to be on their game. Williams slams the ball to his boot, dishes it off to the running player. Sicily gets the mark without contest. Going for goal number two. Off by a matter of centimetres. Look at that behind tally for Hawthorne. Lots of wasted opportunities there. Looks like he'll go out wide. Rioli taps. He's got it. Sicily. Thompson with the mighty fist. It looked impossible, but somehow he made it possible. The second goal for Henderson. Replays are great when you can see how talented these guys are at conjuring something out of nothing. Henderson knows that was something special. You can feel the intensity build as both Ruckman prepare for the bounce. Hit by McAvoy. Zeebel has the ball. He's got the footy in his hands. A clean pickup. Turner comes away with the ball. Has it now. Turner gets the tap. Burton really wears his heart on his sleeve. He clears the ball. He gets a fist to it. Sicily with the spoil. O'Brien with handball. Henderson marks it. 35 metres out. The ball is stuck towards goal by Henderson. Hawthorne leads by 17. The replay capturing everyone's attention. What a goal. He acknowledges the crowd. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. Here's the bounce. Punched by Thor. He's got the footy in his hands. The umpire says, give it to me. Hit by McAvoy, and that's the game. Hawthorne, 46, to North Melbourne, 29. What? Oh, they're telling me that's only the end of the third quarter. Richo, now with his stats. Well, the scoreboard says they're winning, but you wouldn't have thought so looking at those stats. Hadn't thought of it quite like that, Richo. It's almost over now. You're never a loser until you quit trying. McAvoy decisively. Sicily made the awkward bounce look easy. He's got great hands. Rioli lining up. 50 metres from home. Rioli takes aim for goals. Through for a point. Well, that puts another behind on the scoreboard. The pressure just eased off for Cawthorn. They've now got a three-goal lead. Thompson is a great kick and if he can maintain that accuracy under pressure he'll elevate to the elite category
Clark gets onto the ball. He's got the ball out even when being tackled. He slams that on the boot. Atley drops the ball. The ball is scooped up. Wood taps it. Impey handballing to his own advantage. Burton with the kick. Good mark. Pewopolo feeling the pressure gets the quick kick away. Clark kicks it. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Sends it on its way. A mark by Gore. Gore needs to do a little bit more work on his jumping. He can get some good height, but it's the timing that's not quite there. He takes the contested mark. He boots it. That's a mark. Wood lines up. He kicks the ball. He comes off hands. Stratton intercepts it. He boots it. Has the mark all to himself. Crawley sends one up towards the wing. O'Brien has a great set of hands. Fantastic mark. He has to hold on to those. Burgoyne has been a step and a half too slow all game. He steadies now in front of goal. 50 metres from home. The ball is slammed towards goal by Sicily. He gave it a crack but it sailed wide of the goal. The Hawks leads by 19. Needs someone to break hard. He's ready to bring it back into play. Thompson kicks hard along the boundary line. When you look at the set shots at goal, there just aren't enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to mark. If the Kangaroos' forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50, they just need to be given a shot. Bruce takes the uncontested mark. 30 metres from home. A chance to add one more to his tally. Fantastic goal by Bruce. The lead has been increased. That's five in a row for the Hawks. Hawthorne lead North Melbourne 54 to 29. Bruce can achieve anything he sets his mind to. The sky is the limit for this guy. He's loving that replay. <laughs> and he's making sure his opponent knows all about it. He's excited about that one. The Ruckman giving each other the ice-cold killer stare-downs as they wait for the bounce. First hand's important. Virtual is able to grab it on the half volley. The ball being picked up before it makes its target. Burgoyne has it. Boots it. Zeebel wins the marking contest. Kicks. Great mark. Hard time. Trimming the grass with that kick. Hard time with the tap. Athlete gets the tap. Gains possession. Sends it on its way. A mark by Puopolo. Puopolo. He's pretty good at hangers. He just needs to work on getting some more height if he really wants to master the skill. He kicks the ball. Strong mark there. Going for goal number one. Goal. That could be the final nail in the coffin. The kick is about as straight as a shopping trolley, and it's a goal. You can see it on his face. He's happy with that effort. The Ruckman steal themselves before the bounce. Umpire bounces the ball. McAvoy thumps it forward. He gets his hands on the footy. That doesn't look too good. He must be injured. No way he'll come back after an injury like that one. 50 metres out. He's on a 30-degree angle. Sicily presents and takes the mark. Don't take too long lining up for goal. Invariably, the mind messes up more shots than the body. 20 metres out. Gunston taking a chance at goal. That could be the final nail in the coffin. The kick is about as straight as a shopping trolley, and it's a goal. He's excited about that one. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. The bounce, laser straight. Guided by Schellenmakers. 
Clean tap by Schellenmakers. He runs into the goal. Oh, you can really tell he loves taking a contested mark. Now, this shouldn't be too hard for Gunston. Gunston launches one towards goal. Never looked like going through. The Hawks with a healthy gap on the scoreboard, leading the Kangaroos 67 to 29. Thompson decides to play on. Thompson kicks hard along the boundary line. Clark clearing it out of defence. McMillan takes the mark. North Melbourne just aren't running for each other and creating any space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many shots inside 50. Puts boot to ball. Gore with the ball. He slams that on the boot. Atlee wins the contested ball, sending it on its way. Shields with good strong hands. Jams it on the boot. I reckon my mum could have caught that in a pin. The ball's come out of the pack like a chocolate bar from a slot machine. Kicks it. Drops the ball. Lucky bounce collected. Roost has seen plenty of the footy. That could be the final nail in the coffin. I've got to say, that's even a better goal the second time around. Roost celebrates. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Dork with the tap. Clean hands with a difficult bouncing ball. A great effort. Rioli boots it. Almost a touch of synchronised swimming about that mark. That was the peg. Takes that one strongly. 45 metres out. Boots it. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. 25 metres out, Sicily, with quite a challenge in front of him. Slots it, Sicily, kicks his second, and that puts them further in front. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Dorg taps it. Bounces favorably for Birchall. Mitchell taps it. Off the ground. The ball came out of the pack like a wet salmon. A good mark under the circumstances. 40 minutes from home. Roost booting it inside the 50. Lucky bounce collected. Tarrant with the mighty fist. Gunston getting accustomed to kicking goals. That's 10 in a row for Hawthorne. That could be the final nail in the coffin. Like a banana through a letterbox. What a wonderful goal. Gunston celebrates. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. The ball has been bounced. Door thumps it forward. What a valiant effort from Hawthorne. What were your thoughts on the match, Richard? Well, that's just a shocker from North Melbourne. Red-hot favourites with the bookies, but big losers here today. The stats don't lie. They never looked in the hunt all day, and there'll be some soul-searching back at the club this week. Much appreciated, Richard. At the end of the game, Hawthorne are leading the Kangaroos 85 to 29. Thanks for joining us, Richard, but that's all we have time for. It's been a pleasure, Dennis. We'll catch you next time.